TikTok is up to something. And people are saying that this is supposed to be a Instagram killer. What's poppin', what's poppin', what's poppin'? Now, let me be honest. I think Instagram has been dying for a while, especially on the photo side. Now, if y'all remember back in July of 2022, the head of Instagram said something like this. The second thing I'm hearing a lot of concerns about right now are photos and how we're shifting to video. Now, I wanna be clear. We're gonna to continue to support photos. It's part of our heritage. You know, I love photos. I know a lot of you out there love photos too. That said, I need to be honest. I do believe that more and more of Instagram is gonna become video over time. In translations, photos do not matter anymore. They're going to a video first platform and everybody gave them backlash. So much backlash that about a year later that they finally gave a new feature to photos with single images and carousels by adding music and they've been giving a little bit more reach to photos. Now, will Instagram ever be back on its prime with photos? I don't think so. I think that's all the way dead, right? And now, especially since TikTok is coming out with its own photo app. Yeah, so let's get right into that. TikTok is coming out with TikTok Notes, which is their own photo app, which I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm a little bit confused because carousels do amazing on TikTok, sometimes even better than some people's videos. So I'm not, I'm not really sure why they're doing this photo app. Now I do have some thoughts. One, can this be the answer to keep US users into a different app so that if this ban does happen, they still have that information, which then brings up another point. Like, would this actually be part of the ban since it is technically called TikTok? I have so many questions. Here's another concern. Are we too video heavy that does it even matter if there's another photo app? Like y'all remember that one, that Vero one, Vero, whatever it was called. It was supposed to be photos only and it was supposed to kill Instagram and that didn't happen. Then we got Be Real, which was supposed to be like a more unfiltered Instagram and that didn't kill it. So I'm not really sure if there really is anything that can kill Instagram besides Instagram. And let's be real. The photo app is going to be more for my introverts and have introverts really just settled with places like X, Threads, and even LinkedIn because they're not so video heavy, at least yet. Because we know some changes are about to happen, but we could talk about that in another video. Personally, I've never shared a photo on TikTok. That's probably the last thing I think about when it comes to TikTok. I just think about videos and more videos and more videos. Now I do know carousels work, I just haven't done it. Now for me, IG has been a hit or miss. I talked about it in my last video. Go check that out. I'll put that somewhere up here somewhere. But what I do know when it comes to any new social media platform is this one thing, and that's organic reach. The organic reach is about to go crazy when TikTok Notes comes out. So how do we take advantage of this organic reach that is about to happen? So first, when is TikTok Notes coming out? I'm not really sure, but I do wanna prepare for it regardless if it does come out like tomorrow, next week, next year, but then also, to always have content ready for Instagram and LinkedIn as well. Let me let me break this down. Hold up, hold up, hold up, okay? I know the video is dope, but in the link in the description is my newsletter, Content Corner. Really dope. I talk about social media tips, AI tips, content strategy, everything pretty much that you've been seeing in this video has already been in the newsletter. So. Go sign up. I'm giving you a 30 day social media planner that me and ET did. All right, let's get back into this video. My bad, I'm sorry. Oh, and can you subscribe to the channel if you haven't? Okay, let's get back to the video. So to get ready for TikTok notes, especially for my video first people, let's make some of our videos into images. Wait, I could turn my videos into images? Yep, it's actually pretty easy. So let's go prepare for this. I want you to transcribe your videos. Now there's two ways to do this. One, you could do Riverside transcriptions, that's super free. Or two, Otter AI, that is a paid one, but you could try it for free. Step two, I want you to go into ChatGPT and I want you to take that transcription and I want you to tell ChatGPT to suggest you some of these images. So what it's going to do is going to give you a text that you can either use Dolly 3, 
Mid Journey or even Canva to create these images. Now you could do all images or you can actually create this into a carousel which i'll tell you to go back into canva because when it comes to carousels you want to put the text on the images and dolly 3 and mid journey aren't the greatest when it comes to text now we got our images now we can put that in tiktok notes when it comes out or you could put it on ig as a single image or a carousel or you could put it on linkedin because actually they take images as well and their organic reach is pretty fire Wait, I thought we were talking about TikTok notes. We are, but might as well leverage the content that we just created. So if TikTok notes, Instagram and LinkedIn all take images, we might as well take advantage of what we created. So quick recap, we're going to do one, we're going to transcribe our videos. Two, we're going to take that transcription. We're going to chat GPT to tell it to give us some image descriptions. Three, we're going to take it into an AI art generator, whether that's Dolly, Mid Journey, or Canva, because Canva has an art generator in there. And we're going to create images and carousels. Four, we're going to take those and we're going to post it on TikTok notes when it comes out, IG, and LinkedIn. So regardless of how this goes, we're ready for anything. If TikTok notes blows up, we're ready and we have consistent content. If it doesn't come out for a while, we at least have Instagram and LinkedIn content. Shoot, we can also put that back on TikTok for the carousels until the ban does the banning thing, you know? Now remember, there's not a release date for TikTok notes or maybe even by the time you watch this, it's already out. There is a website, it doesn't say too much, but what do you think about TikTok notes? Are you excited about it? Do you think it's going to kill Instagram? Does it not even matter? Do you even care about a photo app? You let me know. And don't forget, check out my next video that talks about AI and some more social media tips to get you ready for this organic reach.